In our tasting room, you can try over 100 different beverages of Coca-Cola from around the world today for free. So you can drink as much as you like today. Don't worry, we have plenty of restaurants to help you all out those flavors as well, all right? My name is Michael. I'll be your ambassador for this room and the next. I'm originally from Baltimore, Maryland, and my favorite drink in the tasting room is Melon Frosty from Asia. So try that when you get in there. But that is enough about me. I want to know more about you, of course. Is anybody here visiting from a different country? Do we have any international guests? Is any? All right, where are we coming from over here? Colombia. Colombia. How's it going? All right, anyone else? Right back here. Venezuela. Venezuela. Hello. Peru. Peru. How's it going? Right here. Puerto Rico, how's it going? Anyone else over here? <laughs> India, how's it going, my friend? Anyone else from a different country? Anyone else? Am I missing anyone right here? New Jersey. New Jersey. Who <laughs> 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 else? Let's, let's give a round of applause for our international guests. <laughs> <laughs> All right, All right uh, what about out of state? Out of state? Anybody want to share right over here? Minnesota, how's it going? Anyone else? Texas, don't mess with Texas. People. <laughs> How's it going right here? San Francisco. San Francisco. Hello, anyone else? Anyone else? How's Wisconsin. It Wisconsin. How's it going right over here? Atlanta, local. How's it going? Anybody else from Georgia here? Anybody else from Georgia? There we go. There go my locals. All right. Well, as everyone see, we come from many states and countries, but we all have one thing in common, and that'll be our love for Coca. Cola. Cola. <laughs> Coke. <was> Coke. <laughs> I'm gonna try this again. I caught y'all off guard, all right? So everyone see me come from many states and countries, but we all have one thing in common. Now that we all love for Coca. Cola! Give me a quick little history lesson. I'll ask first. Does anybody know who invented Coca Cola? Anybody know? Any names? Some statue? Park? Starts with, I think I heard it. Somebody said it? Pemberton. Pemberton, there we go. All right, little man. <laughs> I'm just I'm by the name of Dr. John S. Pemberton, invented Coca Cola on May 8, 1886, right here in Georgia, about a mile away where you're standing at. Now, he was a pharmacist in Jacobs Pharmacy. So, that means coming up this year, the Coca Cola Company will be celebrating their 129th anniversary. Now in these glass cases, you'll see these cardboard cutouts. They are called festoons. Festoons date back to your 1920s, 30s, and 40s. They're placed in pharmacy windows and restaurants to let people know that Coca-Cola could be purchased there. Now if you look at this particular festoon, it says drink Coca-Cola five cents. Yes, this means Coca-Cola originally sold for five cents. Stayed that way for 70 long years. Just five old cents. Now if you ask me, that was good times back then, right? Five cents for Coca-Cola. All the way up to 1956, where we decided to change the price. Fans found out the new price. They was outraged. They couldn't believe it. We changed it from five cents to an unheard of. Anybody want to guess? Seven. Seven? Okay, a dollar. Where did it go? Ten cent? Worse than that, it was six cents. Yes. <laughs> called it highway robbery. They could not believe that extra penny. Now, if you look down here below, you see these two piggy banks. They're from the 1950s and 60s. They were given to children as gifts. Every time they put a penny inside to save their money, they get a sip of Coca Cola back in return at the bottom of it. So the more money they save, the more Coca Cola they got to drink. The best of both worlds, right? Now, if you look right between that, you see the Coca Cola six pack holder? Yes, to all my six pack lovers in here, you can thank Coca Cola for that. It was the first ones to invent the six pack back in 1923. Back then, you get a six pack of Coca Cola. Anybody want to take a wild guess at that? 10 cents, okay. What else? 30 cents. 3 cents, 12. All right. Huh? What'd you say? You might have been close. I didn't say nothing. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And that one was 25 cents. Yeah, 25 cents for a six pack back then. They had all the best prices back then. Now, how they came up with this was the modern family consisted of six. So you had your mother, your father, the three children, and of course, the one we love the most. The mother-in-law, how about that? <laughs> now, our oldest artifact in this room will be this Victorian serving tray from 1897. Now, back then, when you gave me five cents up and you were ready to receive your Coca-Cola beverage, that bring it right to you on that tray in a fancy way. So that's our oldest artifact in this room. Right next to that, we have a Norman Rockwell painting. This is called Barefoot Boy. Pretty obvious why it's called that. Now, Norman Rockwell was comm commissioned to do six paintings for us. We only own three of them. So if you have the remaining three, in your attics, basements, you know, hanging on your wall next to your family chair. Bring that into us, and you'll never have to work another day in your life, all right? Just give yourself about those paintings. Now, if you look down here below, 
You see our Contier bottle. We're celebrating the 100th anniversary of the Contier bottle. Now, this bottle started in 1915. That particular mold right there is from 1956. Now, when you go into the hub area, you'll see two glass cases dedicated to our Contier bottle with bottles that's designed from all over the world. So, see if a few of your countries sent some in. Pretty nice bottles. You can get pictures of those as well. Now, towards my right, we have a lovely picture of Raquel Welsh from the 1970. She's wearing our dynamic ribbon design, which was a brand new look for the Coca Cola ad campaign. You now can find that dynamic ribbon design on the Coca Cola bottles and cans. The accessory she's wearing in the picture, the, with the uh, ring, the bracelet, and the belt, is right next to her picture on the shelf. Now, if you was ever curious how we came up with this dynamic ribbon design, we just sent it to the Coca Cola bottle and laid it on its side and traced it. So that's where that design comes from. Is anybody here familiar with what kind of she is? All right, there we go. Some of the older men know. All right, there we go. All right. Now, now, she was like the Kim Kardashian of my generation. All right. Now, the only difference was she had class and talent. All right. Now, I noticed that as you came in, you couldn't keep your eyes off our lovely Coca Cola hip hop appearance of 1972. For $2.98 and a proof of purchase, you two would have owned those groovy beach bands back then. See a few of you eyeballing them pretty hard, like you're ready to bring this look back today. Well, don't worry, we'll help you out with that. In our retail store, you can get a replica looking pajama pants, men's and women's sizes. Unfortunately, they're not $2.98 anymore, but I'll let you figure that price later on in the self got it to, all right? Now, you may have noticed those flashing lights and that indicate that we have 20 more seconds left to here. You're going to see a six second set of flashing lights and my doors to the right and left will open. We have a special film prepared for you all called Moments of Happiness. Fair warning to you all about this film. It will make you happy, all right? So just put a big smile on your face. My name is Michael. It's a pleasure to have you all. I hope you have a great time here.